It's a Saturday morning. Rose woke up singing, but Troy woke up in a bad mood. He was grumbling about the house. First, he complained about people who spent all their money gambling, especially a black man named Pope. Then he grumbled about Curry and how lazy the boy was. Rose told him that Curry only went for football practice, but Troy said Curry did that because he wanted to avoid working on building their fence. Troy's brother, Gabriel, enters the house. He is a disabled man who got his injury fighting as a soldier during the war. Gabe believes he is an angel, so he carries a trumpet around his neck. To make money, Gabriel sells fruits. He always feels that Troy is angry at him, but Troy denies it. Gabe tells Troy that he moved out of the house to stay with Miss Pearl so he can be independent and to make Troy proud of him. Rose tried to offer Gabe breakfast, but he said he had eaten. Rose became worried that Gabe doesn't eat at his lodge. While everyone was proud of Gabe and the progress he was making, Troy wasn't happy. He wanted Gabe to be free and experience peace after a long life at war as a soldier. At the end of the scene, Rose is concerned that Troy could be worried that it was the money that the government gave Gabe that he used to get their house. Yet, his brother couldn't live there with them. See you next time.